Hey everybody, welcome out to another episode of Bald Up Genetics. My name is Lloyd. If you like reptiles, especially snakes, then this channel's for you. guys so before we get into this you know the drill please subscribe down below if you haven't already turn on that post notification bell so every time we upload a video which typically is on Tuesdays you're gonna be notified about that also if you can do us a favor and go on to bald up genetics on morph market we would greatly appreciate it all right everybody I have a very special unboxing for you guys today it's uh, my wife's birthday technically it was my wife's birthday Got our special snake for her, uh, and you're gonna see that unboxing right now. Hey everybody, so I am here in my office uh, at work, so shh, we'll let them know I'm doing this. Uh, and I have a package, an unboxing to do for you guys today. So I have this unboxing to do. Uh, this is actually a present for my wife for her birthday. Uh, unfortunately it was not shipped so it would get to her on her birthday so I just now went and picked it up from FedEx uh, I'm going to unbox it right now to see how he's doing uh, show you guys and then I'm gonna wrap it all back up and tonight I'm gonna give it to her uh, her big thing is uh, boa constrictors so she's wanting she's breeding different different uh, morphs of boa constrictors so I have one in here that's a pretty good powerhouse male uh, for her and her group that she's using right now. So let's get into this unboxing so you can see what it is. Let's kind of do this with one hand. Uh, so we got this, or so I picked up this boa from uh, Legion Red Tails and Exotics up in uh, Fort Worth. So, uh, I'm not gonna, whoop, there's, there, there's a sneak peek of what it was. Uh, but he has everything listed on it. I'll show it to you in a second. It has what the snake is, uh, date of birth, ID, all that good stuff. Uh, it's still a young one. off to the side and of course there's a zip tie he does have what it is on the bag too Boop. but we will not do that let me get this set up all right so hopefully i do this with scissors without hurting myself too bad Actually, let's just do it with this. I can get underneath it better. Always cut away from you and the snake. My blade is, there we go. All right, put all this away. All right, so again, uh, I was looking for this particular morph. Uh, it's it's getting hard to 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 get them because everybody's buying them up. But uh, all right, so he's <laughs> there. He is. There he is. Yeah, he looks hungry. All right, guys. So this is an IMG. This we're going back in the bag. So this is an IMG, uh, which stands for Increasing Melanistic Gene, uh, and he's a hundred percent het call albino. So he's going to get darker and darker. If you can see right here in the spots, you can see those little you can see those little black flakes uh, as he gets older. It, more of that melanin, more of that black 
pigment is going to start taking over. Now, um, the one that I would have preferred would have been the Motley in IMG because those two genes combined together make for a, a solid black snake. Uh, but again, those are very, very hard to get a hold of. Once they're up on Morph Market, um, people snag them up pretty quickly. And the IMG gene, the increasing melanistic gene, is an expensive gene. Uh, so some of them are, are way out of my price range. Uh, but this guy should get pretty dark. Going to fit in really well with the plans that she has for uh, the, the bow constrictors and the uh, different morphs that we have. Uh, so I think she's going to be pretty excited about it. Uh, this is one of the mm, most expensive uh, bows that we have right now. Um, so we're going to take our time with him, grow him up, and then uh, we will get him into uh, the breeding program. Let him calm down a little bit. And uh, the next thing you see will be some close-ups of him, and then we'll wrap all this up. All right. Oh, here we go, everybody. The anticipation. Oh, no, the excitement. I think she's happy, everybody. I think she likes it. All right. Okay, everybody, so that's it for this video. Just a quick unboxing showing you the, the snake that we got for my wife for her birthday. Uh, I can't wait to show you guys in a couple of months and as the next year and two years go by to show you how dark this snake gets. Um, real quick, being that it is really, again, the ball python breeding season or the start of it, I know a lot of people have already started putting their snakes together it's here in December. I'm a little late on doing it this year. But I'm going to go through with a couple of videos showing you uh, the pairs that we're going to try to put together, see what we get, go over uh, extra feeding of them, uh, ultrasounding as they start to develop follicles or eggs inside, and then you'll see the, all the routine. When they lay the eggs, pulling them, putting them in the uh, boxes, putting them into the incubator once after 50 Usually in my incubator, it's about 54 days. They start to hatch out. I, I do wait for the first couple of them to start hatching before I cut eggs, and we'll see all that. In between all that, we'll still show you more boas, all the different species of boas that we have, the tortoises that we have. So just stay tuned for all of that. Uh, but again, until the next video, take care, and we'll see you again real soon. Bye, everybody.